this video segment, we are going to unbox our new 1783 NAR module. Inside our box, we have the NAR and the SD card. Uh, both of them are stored in their ESD bags, which helps prevent against uh, electrostatic issues from manufacturing and shipping. So on our NAR module, on the back side of the module itself is the slot for the SD card. So you cannot access the SD card when the module is actually attached to a DIN rail. The other thing to note is the NAR has three ethernet ports, one on the front and two on the bottom but it only has two network interface cards or two NIC cards. Um, and that is the, there's one for the front, which is your public or uplink port. And then there is one for the bottom two ports. Um, so the bottom two ports are your local ports and they have the same IP address. So they can work as a device level ring or DLR. And the other option is to do a linear topology where you daisy chain equipment in one port and back out the other. There are also three dip switches on the NAR module that are on the top of the module. So the dip switches allow quick configuration changes to the module, such as factory reset, storing information or loading information from the SD card and assigning temporary IP addresses. On the side of the NADR module, there is a chart that will explain all the different configuration possibilities for the NADR module. The other thing you have on the NADR module, on the front face, once you power it up, you will have the LED status indicators. So you have your OK light, your link one and link two, which are assigned to the two private ports, and then your public port uh, LED indicator. And that is our initial unboxing of the 1783 NAR module.